State. I was telling the minister, if you see any pothole, it's their own. I don't have any pothole in my state. All my roads are very good roads. And uh, we have done about 1,420 kilometers of state road, not local government, not federal. And this road cut across the nook and crannies of Kebi State. I can say without any contradiction, we have the best roads, one of the best roads in Nigeria. And we are just from the uh, rice field. What we want to do is, we want to cut KB into different sectors, so that transportation will be very easy. I'm sure these days, if you don't want to cross local government, there is nowhere that you can go. Within 30 minutes, you will not reach where you want to go. Unless if you are going to places like Zuru, Wara, that you can use five hours to go to. And now within two hours you will be there. Before, if you are going to Wara, you have to go through Niger. Today, you can easily go to Niger. People follow our own road to go to their own areas now. There is a, a road that we'll see here from Bachaka, uh, from not in the end here, to Bachaka. Minister is here, he can testify. If you are to go there before, you'll spend nothing less than 18 hours to go and come back. Today, in 15 to 20 minutes, you are there. It's at the border of Niger. Why Why you cannot be there? You cannot even go with uh, any vehicle that will not be a four-wheel drive because of this kind of a sun. In, the, in, in Bachaka Road, I'm sure you have up to two to three meters of sand. So you find people just cutting anywhere to, with their four-wheel uh, drive. But today it is a well-canalized route, and in 30 minutes you'll be there. We are doing another route, just if we go out here, going to Augi. That one is an old road, we are rehabilitating it, so we are asphalting the whole route. And this is how the whole roads in Kevin State are. In the course of a tour by tomorrow, next day, you will see what I'm talking about. Thank you very much. We have a policy. We do urban renewal, five kilometers. We have not done that here because it's, some of them are small villages. But all the local government headquarters, we intend to do urban renewal so that we'll have an out, a very good outlay of all the routes. And... Uh, this is why if the economy of the river valley, the rise, the economy will improve all these villages that you are talking about. Yes, that is what I'm saying. Uh, that is over renewal. In short, in Birmingham, you, if you go to Birmingham with Aikingari, Kamba, Jega, you will see it in reality. Even if you ask people, they will tell you how much they have been compensated and what they have done with the money. And that is the way we redistribute the wealth in every state. Because you can't give people free money, but you can bring programs that will alleviate the poverty. And we have been doing that in Kebi consciously. Thank you very much. Your Excellency, this is the 120 kilometer road project. When did you start? Is it completed and how much? Uh... That is why I came to the end of the road. You can see the remaining there. The only thing, this is the first uh, court. So the second court is around uh, Tilly, about 45 kilometers from here, 48 from here. So second court is very easy. The major work is the first court and the ass work, and which has been finished. That's why I stood at the end of the road. Tomorrow I will show you the beginning of the road, inshallah. And at what, what cost to the government? About five billion. And there are a lot of bridges, about five, four or five bridges of the road, major bridges. And this is where you can never come to some years back because the terrain is very bad. I could remember during the campaign of 2007, we spent the whole day here from morning till three o'clock in the night. The same thing with the other one that I was talking about, but the Bachaka Road. I've spent almost a whole day on that route. And it's a distance of about 60 kilometers. Thank you very much. So for now, we should say about 70% completed. 80. 80.
other questions.